Hello viewers. How are you? Welcome to the second lecture of 2D transformation. In the previous lecture, I have discussed on translate method. Now, I will teach you, how to rotate an element with the help of rotate method. Rotate value provides the ability to rotate an element, around a fixed point on the 2D plane. When you rotate an element, its shaft does not change, but its angle has changed. As I have told you, rotate value spins an element around a fixed point. Fixed point is that on which element rotates. Fixed point is also known as the transform origin. When you use rotate value, its default origin is the center of the element. But you can set your own custom transform origin, using transform origin property. Rotate value accepts values in angle units. These units may be degrees, radians, gradients, or turns. One complete rotation is equal to 360 degrees, 6.28 radians, 400 gradients, and one turn. Angle can be the both positive and negative. Positive value rotates an element in clockwise. And negative value rotates an element in opposite direction. Opposite direction is counterclockwise. See the visual to learn clearly. In this visual, I will use degree unit.
When you put negative value, its movement will be in counterclockwise. In this visual I will use Roddy Ian's value. As I have mentioned before, if you put rotate value into radians, so one rotation circle is equal to 6.28 radians. 6.28 radians is equal to 360 degree. Three point one four radians is equal to one hundred and eighty degree. One point five seven radians is equal to ninety degree. 0.735 radians is equal to 45 degree. 400 gradients are equal to one rotation. 400 gradients are equal 360 degree. 300 gradients are equal 270 degree. 200 gradients are equal 180 degree. 50 gradients are equal 45 degree. 4. One turn is equal to one rotation. One turn unit is equal to 360 degree. 0 0.50 turn is equal to 180 degree. 0 0.25 turn is equal to 90 degree. 0.125 turn is equal to 45 degree. 0.125 In this lecture, I have discussed rotate method in detail. If you have liked our video, Please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon, so you could receive our latest videos on time.